the Mendenhall Wastewater Treatment Facility was my first summer job, as in, you know, 40 hours a week on a payroll, you know, that kind of thing. Lab technician. Took samples in the SBR tanks, which were huge. I mean, these things were, you know, like small swimming pools. There's catwalks over them. I would lower the pole down with a bleach jug on it, pull up the sample, measure it for oxygen levels, and take it back to the lab, check for bacteria, uh, those four kinds that we looked for, take notes on, We'd measure it to the ten thousandth of a gram on a, on a uh, Put it on a filter, bake it in the autoclave, weigh the filter first, weigh it with the sample on it, and subtract yada yada. And I'd take it samples from the tower, which was part of the old plant. It was several story, it was a, it was the biggest outhouse I ever saw. It was huge, it was like, you know, several stories tall. And inside it had redwood crates crisscrossed all the way up to the top. And they'd run sprinklers at the top and it would trickle down and evidently bacteria would live on the crates and would help process it on the way down. So uh, and then I'd go to the old plant itself, which is they were still using, and take samples there. Those tanks were much smaller. My boss Kathy fell in there once, but that's more like a waiting pool. <laughs> Not a big waiting pool, but I mean, the big SBRs, they say, oh man, if you fall in there, nobody hear you scream. Especially since if the pumps come on, they could suck you right down to the bottom. And, uh, well, there was uh, graveyard, there was a um, swing shift. So it's just me and Kathy and maybe one other guy that was there at night. But I got to go downtown and bug everybody <laughs> during the day. That was the fringe benefit. Dave Fricky was the manager. Uh, I don't remember Kathy's last name, but oh yeah, fun times. That was the summer of my junior year. <laughs> 